the dirty love and know that you can shoot it at Shawty holler, let me hear you say it. Come and get it, make me part of that Baby, come and get the shooty first When I'm out of time, we just want to drive me crazy But I'm not you Are you live on L S C T V Part you are one on one And today I have my guests are from outside Uganda That's why actually my accent is now changing yeah, yeah. Uh, From northern Uganda to somewhere I else now you. <laughs> My guest today is from abroad, not from Uganda. Uh, that's wow. why my accent is changing oh bit by God. bit. Oh, you most welcome to the LCC TV. Yo, thanks a lot, buddy. Mm. Yeah. Uh, what's your name? My name is Sophie Irina Kulu. That's my name. A, a real name, yeah. See, that's you call a Kulu. Yeah, that's my name. Okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> we have a Kulu here, but uh, the, the, accent, uh, the accent is from uh, uh, USA. Uh-huh. Sure. <laughs> that's real. <laughs> Okay, you see the Akulu? Yeah, Akulu Irene Sofi, that's my real name. Akulu Irene Sofi. Uh -huh, yeah, and then the stage name is Real Meets. Real Meets, like real. real. Meets. Yeah. Uh, Sofi, yeah. Oh, what type of music do you do? I do hip hop, RB, hip hop, trap, like the trap kind of hip hop. Mm. I do RB, and I do a little dance hall. A little dance hall. But, but someone, I do dance hall, but I, I don't do it a lot. Someone from outside may be doubting. Can you uh, give us a couple of, of one of your song? It's okay. I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, should it be the the, the recent song or because I already got three any, songs any, right now? Any, any, any. Uh, actually, my accent is now changing. Any, I get it. I get any. it. I get it. You, you can, can do, do any. any. Yes, I got any. you. I got yeah. you. All right. Okay. From the first time I saw your love was in a band yeah. We could hit the band thinking you could do the band then yeah. Our surface you just hope you could let me enter Got the dirty love and know that you could suit it better Shout it out loud, let me hear you say Come and get it, make me part of that Baby, come and get the shooting stars When I'm out of time, bitches wanna drive me crazy But I let you in cause I thought you could turn this my life Look at me, tell me the time, what could it be? Yeah, cause I'm trying to be real I never wanna wow, pretend wow, that what wow, you do wow, You're making wow, me feel wow, like wow. you <laughs> Yeah, wow, yeah. Sophie, this uh, is fire. Uh, yeah, yeah. Ah. Would you me. mind when they call you a cool? Yeah, I'm cool. I'm cool. That's my name, nigga. Oh, sorry. Yeah. But no, the accent is, is very, very far from a cool. I know, but that's my name, and I love it a lot. Like, uh, I Sophie, love it. are you the one who writes your song, or there's someone who writes for you and uh, you just sing? No. Lyrically, I want to say I'm talented. I write my lyrics. Mm. It doesn't come from the blues. Like, you feel like I need to write about this. Mm. I write about what happens in the lifetime. What people go through, what lovers go through when the heart broken, when you're happy in a relationship, how you feel, because I feel it too. And so you also them. produce a song from Lira or yeah, you produce sure. them from sure, outside sure. Uganda? I'm not really. I'm a product of Kick Avenue. Mm. A big shout out to all my niggas, Kick Avenue. I'm a product, so I do with Bros and Beat, the beat killer. I love the nigga like crazy. It's good, you know. And my recent song right now, he did it and trust it's hitting like crazy, so I love it. Wow. So I'm, I'm a cake product. So you're from Brosy Beat, right? Exactly. Well, thank you so much for those who are watching RCC TV from wherever you are. Today we have a guest from outside Uganda but staying in northern Yo. Uganda. Sophie. Yo. Oh, have you ever done any uh, collab with uh, any artists in Uganda or outside Uganda? Uh, honestly speaking, I want to say yeah, but there are artists not known. Like there, there were also upcoming artists like me, but right now I think I'm above them now, so they're not known. Mm -hmm. But a real artist, like somebody know, like the Maros, the the the, you know, whatever. Zero. But you wish to do with one? Yeah, yeah, I really wanna. I really want to. To do with one? Like who? Uh, from Northern Uganda. Uh, or even from outside, cause your accent uh, is across uh, again. Yeah, yeah. You know, when I always mention this, people feel I'm crazy. But but trust me, shit is real. I love Chris Brown. Uh, and if there is a time, if God is going to push me through the nigga, trust me, I, I, I love him. You know, cause first of all, I'm a dancer. Besides hip hop, besides I'm a crazy, I'm a good dancer and not just you know, mimicking, you know. So I follow Chris, I love Chris. And if I'm to give a chance just to shake hands with a nigga and do a music, I'm wow. good. Be ready to hear a banger or a hit from Akulo and uh, Chris this. Brown. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, sure. Sophie. Yeah. When did you start uh, uh, doing the music? Uh, officially, I, I want to say officially, I, um, that was three, two, three, four months ago. Three, four months ago. Yeah, but but your songs me, are now a hit. Yeah, yeah. But me discovering that I could actually sing and do the writing and do my lyrics was way back when I was in P five. Primary five. Primary five. That's what I'm talking about. 
you know that's the time i would really rap my lyrics and be like yo it makes sense and then when i do the rapping you know the people's be like yo this chick got this shit you know she can me i'll be like yeah i got this shit man you know but i started doing officially in june by the end of june 20 something june that's when i brought out you know get up my current song wow uh yeah. so far do you have any new song uh yeah but not released till being worked on in the studio by my producer okay yeah that's brother beat right? brother the beat killer that's great yeah uh sophie oh uh, i know when you're starting things uh, challenges always pass uh, are you also uh, having challenges in music or for you uh, everything are just smooth hell no mm -hmm. and when i say hell no i mean crazy no i got a lot of challenges mm -hmm. you step into this industry and then you'll be like i want to get back I wish I didn't come to do this music shit, you know, because you reach a point you'll be like, because right now the biggest challenge I'm facing, to be honest, is mm -hmm. finance, you know, somebody to back you up financially and then me being a student, you know, you, I feel like, uh, yeah, I, when I go to shows, I make money, but they don't sustain me because I don't go for shows every day, you get, and then uh, we don't have people who really come and step out and be like, you know what, I, I want to handle you financially, I want to do this and that, so trust me, money is a big challenge for me. But I'm gonna make it, you know. I I, I had problems yes, yeah. because lyrically, I write my own songs, you know, mm -hmm. and uh, things to do with promotions. I already got my kick niggas out there, and they do crazy shit. I want to appreciate them because they do shit clean. Oh, uh, you're studying, right? Yeah, at Uganda Martha's University in Kozi, that's main campus. It's, it's in Kozi, BG. Okay. Social work and social administration. Just know after the school, you're going straight to the job. <laughs> Yo, I got you. Th th I got that in plan already. You know, I'm not ready to flirt anytime soon. Of course, someone mm -hmm. like you cannot flop. I don't want to do that. I got you right by my side. Oh, <laughs> uh, Sophia. Yo. Oh, uh, you see, uh, most of the people when they start doing things, there could be someone who inspired him or her. Do you are also someone who inspired you to do music? I got a lot of people who inspired me to do hip hop in particular. Yes. You know, mm. uh, when I was young. I love some of the artists that right now they're already old, the Lil Wayne's, the Nicki Minaj, the stuff, you know, I follow the lyrics. But when I grew and learned the lyrics, the content of the message in the lyrics, yeah. I started looking at artists like Dax, you know, he's he's a common person, a rapper, you know, I know people like Erica Merson, she's good, she she yeah, so Dax, Dax inspired me. Cool. I love it. All oh, you're still listening to LCC TV from wherever we heard. Just know my accent has just changed out from Northern it Uganda to uh, <laughs> South America. Uh, <laughs> don't be surprised when you see me, when you see me now speaking American English because uh -huh. I have an American <laughs> <Yo, behind yeah. laughs> beside me here. Uh, yeah. yeah, from wherever you have me here with Akulu. Uh, you yeah. can't believe that Akulu. Yeah. Do you also speak low? I do. Yeah. I, yeah, I do pretty good both my parents are long so i do I tell you a bit. thank Yo. you so much i'm here with akulu uh, uh the other name sophie and the other names uh -huh. irene akulu sophie the same person with an accent from america uh -huh. not from uganda but i'm also trying to uh to change uh, yeah you try. actually i'm not translating me i'm not speaking english by the oh, way i'm yeah. translating <laughs> <laughs> me i'm just Crazy. translating now from america back to uganda exactly are yes. uh, you doing that real good <laughs> <laughs> oh Sophie, yo. Oh, uh, what now do you plan? Like after three, five months or a year now? I got a lot of plans. In the line that of music. They gotta work in the line of music. Yes. And then the plans I have right now, they're short term plans, not long term. Yeah. First of all, I'm a student and I wanna do all it takes to make sure I finish school. But at the same time, I have always been balancing music and education at the same time and I made it till this far. And so my plan, let me put it in one or two years time, is first of all, elevate my family from the condition we're in right now. You know, I want I'm, my I'm, father to I'm, be proud of me. Yes. My mom to be proud of me. You know, I need everybody who support me. Everybody who see my value. Everybody who is ready to stand in for me. They're going to be proud. I like proud. At yeah. the last moment. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, just know uh, what I heard is only mom and daddy. The rest you can translate by yourself. Ah, crazy. <laughs> ah. Uh, Sophie, yeah. Yo. are you under management or you manage it yourself? I'm under a record label called Kick Avenue. Kick Avenue. Exactly. Where is it located? Is it in Lira, Google, um, Kampala, or it's in, in Lira? And it's just pretty recent. I'm I'm not too old. They're just damn recent, you know. 
but before I was under Exa Flow and uh, entertainment, you know. But then uh, we had an agreement when I told him, I'd be like, I, I need a team, you know. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like since I'm here officially, I feel as if I gotta be with people beside me, talk to me, advise me. So we looked at Cake Avenue and we were good to go, and I was good with everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, the biggest artist. Yo. What's now your last word to your fans, uh, to the, those who love your music? No, you know there's difference between fan and the person who love your music. Sure, uh, sure. What's now your message to them? My message to all of you is believe in me. For everybody that loves my song, everybody that is my fan, I want to tell you to believe in me. You get this kind of music. Is a preaching to the world not to northern Uganda not to Uganda or East Africa or Africa I preach to the whole world and if you flow through my lyrics just like I was telling before that nobody got to give them no matter what believe in yourself my song called get up speaks a lot you know like I told you the, the, the get up song my father still asked me till today be like it go in time wearing on. Like you be like, what the hell? Like like you you got these lyrics. How do you pick these words? Like you they really make sense. Yeah. I tell you, I write out experience. You know, when you are stepping out, you want to be, you know, what you gotta be, what you have to strive rather to be so hard to do is being outstanding. To be outstanding is having the ability or having the sense to do an extraordinary thing or create something extraordinary the people who feel they're perfect are able to wow they're gonna be like yo you nailed it you know and that is what i want to do i came into this industry to preach to you i always love saying that there is that uh, african african american whatever they say if you want to keep a secret from a black person write it down and put it on paper the person is never going to pick. But if you need a black person to pick what you're trying to say, put it down in lyrics. Take to the studio, sing about it. And that is when they're going to realize, yo, she was trying to mean this, you know. And that is what I'm here for. Children, the elderly, the youth, the parents, mothers and fathers and everybody out there. My song is to elevate your soul from depression to happiness. And that is what I'm doing. So all I'm trying to say to all my fans is believe in me. I'm here to deliver the necessary. Period. Wow. <laughs> I'm not going to translate anything there. Ah. The canteen party. Na hane koma we are petitioning. Name one of the bar. We are bar. Lock up. Looking level out. Yo. Yo. Hane koma. Nene do a penny a penny. Balu on kana pelare. We love you so much. We have uh, come to the uh, end of our program Yo. because you are one on one. Um. Uh, today I was I was with a uh, uh, Kuro, but the accent now is changing my accent. I was you, yeah, I feel it. I love it. I, I was with a Kuro. Uh, uh. I was with a Kuro here. Uh, uh, but now we've come to that to the end of the program. Stay tuned, don't move and don't touch it. I'll stay there at mm. LCC TV. Yeah, me love you so much. Much love, original. Yo, bigger. <laughs>